um, did you have to play any songs for your dad? No. I'm doing live now. You don't have to be quiet. <laughs> it's so smoky in here. Look at the light. Let me see. Hi. See how light's like? Yeah. Double light. Hi. Let me turn this other light on. Thank you. This is a very special edition of my Cooking with Chloe live thing. It's Mother's Day. <laughs> Hi. Thank you. Everyone's saying Happy Mother's Day. Cool. It is. Second Mother's Day. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> oh, wait a second. Some of people can, like, join in. This is my mom. You want to come here? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> She's here for Mother's Day. <laughs> Thank you. I love this apron. I got it again at the Once Upon a Time cookbook shop. Love it. It's got little llamas all over it. <laughs> okay, so I'll just go ahead and get started on what I'm making because it's going to take me a minute. Um, I'm making, actually it's really not going to take long at all, it's very easy. So this is inspired by my friend Denise and Carter. They made me like breakfast beyond burgers when I was in Portland for a while. And this is basically just a breakfast, like a beyond brunch burger. That's what it is, beyond brunch burger. That's what we're going to call it. So I'll go ahead and get started on that. So I need my toaster, I've already got that. So this is a super easy thing to make. Um, it's literally just a bagel. Do you want one, Mom? Are you going to eat one? Uh, uh, can I save it for later? Yeah, you can save it for later. Brunch burger, yes. Uh, oh, wait, save it. I always do that every time. I'm like, where did it go? Cool, got it. Yeah, so this is a super easy thing to make, and my friends inspired this, because um, every time I was in, like, every morning when I was in Portland, they made me, like, something very similar to this. So we're just going to cut a vegan bagel, and bagels are usually vegan, just double check. Um, I cut it a little weird, but we're going to put it in a toaster, we're going to do bagel temp. All right. So, first thing we're going to do is make our tofu scramble and our bacon. So, we'll start with tofu scramble. And which, I've already got all the ingredients out. What am I doing? Alright, so I'm going to take Miyoko's butter. And you can use any non-dairy butter. doesn't matter. I'm using Miyoko's just because I happen to have a shit ton of it in the fridge. And I'm just going to put that in my pans so that way I've got something going in here. I get oil. You can use non-dairy oil, you use non-dairy butter, whatever. I'm going to turn it down a little bit. All right. Non-dairy butter all up in there. Cool. And the Miyoko's butter browns like real butter. So be careful of that. So I'm going to take my tofu and I'm using extra firm tofu, just any kind, doesn't matter. Cut that open. And um, you just want to take your tofu block and just break it up. And it's going to smoke because it's very wet. So I got that. Um, what is your replacement for dairy and the non-dairy butter? Um, I can read you what's in the Miyoko's butter. It is organic coconut oil. Um, 
Sorry, my nose is running. Um, organic filtered sunflower oil, organic cashews, organic sunflower lectin, sea salt cultures. Yeah, those allergies are real right now. I'm gonna wash my hands. <laughs> All the happy Mother's Day wishes, by the way. Also, it's very smoky in here. I'm trying to get this open. I'm the only one eating it, so I'm opening it up like that. But open up a knife. There we go. Okay, so the bacon. I'm using benevolent bacon. It's this brand, you can get it at Kroger, most grocery stores. I'm just gonna throw that in my pan. I'm gonna throw a couple pieces in there. And then just read the instructions. So like it says, cook it for so top, preheat lightly oil pan, uh, two minutes per side. Okay. So I'm gonna set a timer for that so I don't forget because I've got so many things going on. Um, my trip was amazing. I had such a good time. I wish I could do it all the time. All right, so for the tofu, I'm gonna put a little bit of soy sauce and you can use tamari, which is gluten-free soy sauce. Just gonna pour a little bit in there. I'm gonna do some turmeric and that's because turmeric adds color to your tofu scramble, kind of makes it look eggy. I'm gonna just mix that now, so it looks like a good color to it. Kinda looks like yellow, like eggy. Where's Jeff and Rory? Rory is taking a nap, I don't know where Jeff went. <laughs> He's somewhere in the house. So, and the next thing I'm gonna do for the tofu scramble is I'm gonna put a little bit of non-dairy milk in it. And I'm using unsweetened almond milk. Sorry, it's so smoky in here. It's just my stove. I don't know why it's so smoky. So I'm gonna put like a splash in there. So I got a splash in my tofu scramble. I'll leave this out in case I need more. Would I ever stream and add people? Sure, I just don't know what to do when I add people because I'm like really awkward and I don't really know what to say or do if I were to add people to it. All right, so we're gonna mix this up a little bit. See how it's starting to get like an eggy color? All right. I'm gonna flip my bacon now. I got tongs somewhere. You don't have to like hide in there. You can come in here if you want. I'm just trying to get out. I know, it's really bad. Do you want me to open the door? Or? I already opened it. Um, let me get some tongs. Okay. Bottom. All right. If someone wants to be in the video, that's fine. I'll do that. However you do it. Wait. Okay. No. Alright, well I tried to add somebody. Alright, I tried to add somebody else. Hold on. Waiting for someone. Howdy. Hi. My first semester, don't talk about that. Um, 
Hi, how are you doing? Happy Mother's Day. I'm great. Just trying to make all this without burning it. It's not going so well. So. Yeah, um, your audio is like really echoey. It's because I have you on a speaker. Hold on, let me turn off the Bluetooth speaker. Talking now? Oh, that's yeah, better. that's better. <laughs> I figured. So how are you doing? Uh, great. I went to an I don't know how show last night. Oh yeah, that's awesome. How was it? It was great. I got a bunch of merch and I got a cassette signed. Nice. That's awesome. <clears throat> I remember one girl got completely knocked down and her head hit the bottom of the pit. Oh shit, that sucks. Yeah. Was she alright? Uh, yeah, but she was, like, crying for, like, a whole 15 minutes. I don't blame her. I would cry, too. I got stuck on my head once at a concert, and, like, I seriously just, like, laid there and thought of my life because I saw it flash before my eyes. Um, hmm. so I don't blame her. Um, so anyways, as far as what I'm cooking, do you have any questions or do you want help with anything? Because <laughs> I'm trying to make this without burning it. I don't um, know. Just wanted to okay. say hi. Wait, what time is it there? It's like noon. Not noon. It's not noon at all. Um, what time is it, Mom? Um, it is 4.51. 4.51. Oh, what time? <laughs> if you can listen. Yeah, so um, right now I'm making the tofu scramble. So I'm going to get back to fun. that just so I don't burn anything. If that's cool with you. Yeah. Well, it's super nice talking to you. You too. Bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, there. I tried to do it. See, I'm super awkward. They were really cool. I'm not. <laughs> All right. So next to the tofu scramble, I'm going to add some kala namak, which is black salt. And this is what gives it the flavor like eggs. So you don't have to use this, but you can get it at most Indian grocery stores. So I'm going to add just a little bit of that. Mix that. And chop up my tofu scramble. I put my recipes on live usually, um, like afterwards. Um, I'll say them and then like I'll post post them afterwards as well. It just depends. I try to post them. I do my best. All right. So next, I'm going to add a couple cloves of garlic to this because I I personally like a lot of garlic. You don't have to add this if you don't want to. Oh, it's okay. I get nervous, too. Like, I can't talk to people, like, seriously. Like, I'm very awkward. It's very hard for me to talk to people. Um, I feel that. <laughs> I dropped a clove of garlic. All right. I'm going to grab another one. Thanks. Um, I'm having a fantastic mother today. It's been great. I'm doing what I do I'm doing what I love best, which is cooking and baking and that kind of thing. I've already baked a little bit. I'll show you guys what I made. Um, Mom, what do you, do you think should go to this tofu scramble? So it's just garlic, turmeric, nutritional yeast. Yeah, nutritional yeah. yeast. Okay. We're going to, so we're kind of making this up as we go. So we're going to add some nutritional yeast to it, which is like got a cheesy parmesan flavor. And we're just going to kind of. Do you do paprika? Yeah, we can just paprika. So you can see what it looks like now. It looks like scrambled eggs, kind of, right? This is hard to multitask. Yeah. My mom is also vegan, yes. Yeah. No, not yet. I'll make, I'll show them. So for Mother's Day, I made my mom a vegan poppy seed cake. It's a very German thing. What's it called? Mannkuchen. Mannkuchen. I made my mom a Mannkuchen. 
You bought your mom an iPad? I made mine a cake. I'm, I don't feel like I've stepped up to a plate now. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so for the tofu scramble, what'd you say after that? Paprika? Maybe something right now, like paprika. Okay, let me look. I've got smoked paprika. Yeah. Maybe. All right, so I'm gonna add some smoked paprika, per like request of my mom. Mm -hmm. Smoked gravy, oh yeah. <laughs> I older add spices, okay? There's two cloves of garlic. Should I add more? That's enough. So. All right. What else should I add? Um, something green. Something green. Like I'm thinking color. Um, something green. Like go get some flowers. But... All right. You guys want to see my garden real quick? I'll, I won't show you my yard because it needs mowed really bad. But I'll show you my garden. Oh, you think I should use kale? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna let's, use kale for my garden. Let's scramble tofu without kale. Uh, I'm gonna get kale. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> so here's some kale from my garden. I'm gonna pluck some of that. <laughs> Alright, so I got some kale from my garden. There's my dog. <laughs> I love my garden. It's so full of like awesome things right now because the rain, it's been raining here nonstop. All right, so we got a little pail. We're going to wash it off. So I'm going to cut out my kale now that I've washed it off. Put it in my tofu scramble. There, that's good. Or should we get more? No, that's good. That's perfect. I give it even tones, colors. So now you got enough green in there? Yeah. Okay. We got enough green, according to my mom. <laughs> Here, I'm going to pull out a little bit, and I want you to try it and tell me what you think. That's a lot. I take a bite. Okay. Tiny bite. And tell me if it needs anything. Mm. Oh, that's Is it good? good? Does it need anything? Mm -hmm. You think it's good? That's good. That's really good. Okay, so our bacon's almost done. And then we can do the burgers. Oh, that's really good. Do I listen to Lana Del Rey? Not really. I should. I, I like the old You like Lana Del Rey? Yep. I got her on my list. <laughs> I can't love Lana Del Rey. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, I'm going to put the bacon aside because I don't want to burn it. it burns that bacon like i love it but it burns super easy like super super easy all right next i'm gonna cook my beyond burgers all right and that is just beyond burgers you can get just about anywhere nowadays and that's six i believe it's six minutes per side let me double check though Um, it is three minutes per side. That's three minutes per side. Because it's not, it's not, it's not meat, so you don't have to make sure you cook it 100% all the way, because, like, it's not going to make you sick. Like, it's, I mean, cook it all the way, obviously, but, like, if you don't, like, it's not going to make you sick or anything like that. Throw all this away. That bacon's really good. I'm making a did it not wait I thought that it pinned did it not I'm making a beyond brunch burger Beyond Brunch Burger. Okay, I'm gonna save that. Let me get the cheese out. So this is my tofu scramble. Looks pretty good, it looks like eggs, right? Got my 
heart cheese. I'm using American um, quality heart cheese. Should I add more people to my video? I don't know. I feel awkward. I feel so awkward doing that. But the person that was on here was great. So I'm trying to think if you I should. Distracted. I get distracted. I don't want to burn something. I don't want to burn something. <laughs> Make that cheese sauce. Do you think how it smells good? Oh, yeah. It's good. It's really good. It's really good. Oh, let me cut this bagel. It does not taste exactly like regular cheese, but I can eat it just cold. Like, it's really good. I mean, nothing, like, you have to, so with vegan things, you have to take in mind that it's probably not going to ex taste exactly like what you're used to, but it'll taste really good in its own way. Does that make sense? Like, this vegan cheese, like, look at it. It looks like cheese. Tastes like cheese. Really tastes like cheese. But it's not going to be, like, exactly the same. It is really good, though. I could eat this, like, all day. All right, I'm going to flip my burgers in a second. I'm gonna put cheese on them. So, favorite song at the moment? I don't know. It depends. You know what? You what? Water park. Water park. Yeah. My mom says water park. I've been vegan for about five years or so, give or take. 2013, my mom says, is when I went vegan. I don't know. She would know better than I would. It's when she sent me away to PETA, is what she said. Oh, I thought you said you sent me away to PETA. I thought you said you said you're going to pee that. He said, he said, a child, go to pee I like it. Um, tantrum? Probably. Alright, this should be done any minute now. I'm gonna put a. So if you want the vegan cheese to melt faster, um, just put a lid over it. So I'm going to grab a lid. Put a lid on it. Um, so like that. So I want my vegan cheese to melt a little faster. It's done. Oh, my cake looks done. Oh, let me grab some ketchup. You want ketchup on it? Mom? You want no. No ketchup? No. It's really good with ketchup. I don't order it. Okay. Baby, what you doing? Oh. I just want to say hi. Hello. <laughs> He's been really good to me all day because it's Mother's Day. He's been good to me every day, though. All right, I'd say this is pretty much done. I'm going to grab a burger. Put it on my bagel. All 
right, so check this out, guys. And gals and everybody. So I'm assembling my breakfast beyond burger. Such a mess, but it's so good. And then a little bit of crispy vegan bacon. And you really don't want ketchup? It's really good. All right, no ketchup. Cross that. There we go. Squish it all down, and there we go. Breakfast, brunch, burger. It's a little burnt, but it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take a picture of it. It's really good. It's, just, it's slightly burnt. It's just the bun, but I have regular buns too. I have regular burger buns. This is a little burnt. Anyways, yeah, my toaster's a little touchy. It does a burner. Yeah, my toaster's a little touchy. Anyways, I'll take a picture. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you later. Bye.